How to Make Greeting Cards in Canva, Canva Tutorial for Beginners 2023. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and absolutely incredible day. I bring you back with yet another video and in this video we're going to be talking about Canva and how you're going to be making greeting cards in this in the easiest, most simplest way. So to basically allow yourself to create a greeting card in Canva, it's uh, quite a, a hefty design process, so uh, please do make sure to fully watch this video till the end to gain the full insight on how you're supposed to do this. And I'm going to, you know, whole design template. I'm going to show you the templates, how you're going to make it from scratch and all that. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. So you start things off with coming to Canva.com. And once you're in Canva.com, you're going to go to, uh, you know, either the create a design section or the template section. And over here, you're going to write a uh, greeting card. Okay. And once you write greeting card, you know, greeting card can be for anything. It could be for football. It could be for your birthday, it could be for any sports event. You know, it's just greetings. You know, if you want to give someone greetings, it could be a wedding card. Uh, it could be, you know, any of these. So, you know, we're going to be talking about this and, you know, these are all the templates. Now, obviously in these templates, uh, there's different designs. Uh, let's say in these templates, you want to go with, um, you know, there's a lot to work with over here. There's some horizontal cards. There's some uh, vertical cards. Let's say I'm going to go with the vertical one because it gives us more, uh, you could say, a harmony to create. In. And once you've gone with one of these, uh, I'm also going to go with something from scratch. So I'm going to go and create a design. And once you go and create a design, I'm going to click on greeting card. Okay, we're going to write that in and here it says group greeting card. It gives us the um, aspect ratio for a greeting card. So you can just go with that. And if you want it to be vertical, obviously you can go it into custom size and you're just going to write 1080 by 1920 or, you know, whatever pixels you want to go with or whatever uh, designation you want to go with and click on create design. So here's a template of a random design. Okay, so let's say I'm going to click on customize this template. Now, once you go with this design, what you can do is you can also go with a design from scratch over here. So this is my from scratch design and this is my uh, initial design. So on the from scratch design, uh, we're going to, you know, work our way through. But first, let's discuss this over here. So as you can see, you know, this is a template that they've given us. I'm just going to wait for the whole template to load up. Once the whole template loads up, trust me, this design is going to look amazing. And we're going to be working on from it in like the most ease you can imagine. So as the template loads up, here we go. Uh, what you're going to want to do is, um, you know, you're going to want to think of a, you could say background, you know, what type of feeling or what type of a feeler or vibe you want to go off with. What type of vibe do you want to give this design? So first of all, you're going to decide the event. So let's say I'm just going to create a normal greeting card. Uh, not for a wedding. Let's go with, um, we're going to read them to some, let's say, uh, event. Let's say a baby shower, okay? So, you know, you can write, um, we welcome you with, uh, let's say, write open hands to this baby shower. Okay, you're just going to write that in. And once you write that in, basically, this is your custom text. And over here, you know, you can write, um, uh, you know, the, the name of the couple whose baby you're going to have. So you can write um, Bailey DuPont and Olivia Wilson or whatever name you want to go with. Then you're going to add the dates. You're going to add uh, the address. You're going to add the, you know, detail to the call. And once you do that, you can add, you know, different designs. Let's say you can add uh, some different elements of babies. I'm going to write baby. And once you're ready, baby, obviously you can add different uh, graphics and elements that uh, are for children. So let's say I'm going to add this. I'm going to remove uh, these flower or floral designs from up here. I'm going to add this baby design up here. So, you know, you get the point. So basically, once you have the template, just uh, go and edit it into great detail with all the different uh, designs you get. So, yeah, you know, just. To add as many elements as you can to make it look good so you know it uh, makes the design quite stand out and uh, yeah that's basically how you're going to work it off from a template now actually you know let's discuss how you're going to do it without a template how you're going to create something like this from scratch so to create something like this from scratch obviously you need a, a solid background color okay so i'm going to go with uh, something light you know let's go with this 
and uh, now you can start adding in your details so first of all let's you know give it some uh, uh let's give it some harmony with some elements in the top so again we're going to go with some uh, baby elements once you write in baby it's going to give you the different elements related to a baby's design i'm just going to wait for that to load up and there you go you get different uh, designs related to uh, a baby shower or this is just for an example a greeting card could be many things not only a baby shower obviously so this is just to give you an example now once you basically choose a good solid background again i'm gonna change it to something more vibrant let's go with the pink color and once you go over here i'm gonna go into see all elements related to baby stuff and uh, you know let's add uh, this little thing over here you know it's a little baby widget design so i'm gonna add this over here oh and down here you can add your details for your greeting so first of all we're going to go with a solid like text uh, obviously go with a text that uh, doesn't ruin the style the overall look of the design so let's go with this this looks really nice so i'm going to add that i'm going to place this right here and uh, first of all let's change the overall color of the text let's go with something that's easier to read in this design there we go then you can uh, write your basic text let's say i'm going to switch this up and i'm going to write baby shower okay we're just going to go ahead uh once you input that obviously take down the size of the text so you can uh, adjust the text in here once you do that i'm going to bring it a bit up baby shower and uh you know you could say um gender reveal okay so i'm going to go with baby shower and uh gender reveal you're going to write your text reveal okay again and uh, take down the size of the text so it can fit so there we go baby shower and gender reveal and then you can start adding all the details down here as we did in the same design add your text and once you add your text obviously you can add all the details like your address and stuff then down here add your rsvps obviously add more elements uh like this one over here let's say so you can add more elements down here, give more RSVPs, add a little boundary look. Uh, you know, you can add this um, little boundary down here just to give your design a overall good look. Let's say we're going to add this. And once you've completed your design, finally, just go ahead, click on share. Once you click on share, click on download, click on PNG uh, or, you know, what style you want to download it in, and click on download. And that will obviously complete your design. So that is how you're going to be able to make yourself an uh, amazing, you know, design just like this. So that is how you can make greeting cards. So, you know, pretty simple, pretty easy. And that is the overall look of it. Now, if you enjoyed this video, please do make sure to drop down a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.